met her in the club. All the ball is showing love. Can you party with a thug? Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's Trish. If you guys are new, thanks for stopping by and do not forget to hit that subscribe button. And if not, welcome back to my channel. So I went ahead and filmed my skincare routines. I've been wanting to do one for a while. Yes, I know I look tired. It's six o'clock in the morning, but I wanted to get this video done, so I did. <laughs> so yes, I filmed myself doing my skincare routine and I also showed you guys the products. I will also list the products down in the description box so you guys can check it out. Out. Um, if you guys like the video, do not forget to like, like, comment, or subscribe, and I will see you guys in my next one. Hey, my loves, welcome back. So, I wanted to do this video for y'all. So, the first thing I usually do is take off my lashes and I get my simple makeup removal wipes and I just take up take off all my makeup. I usually use one for my face and I use another one for my eyes. And like I said, I do go in with the second one for my eyes. And yes, I know I look hella crazy, but we gotta get this makeup off. The next thing I go in with is my cotton rounds and my Garnier Micellar Cleansing Water. This second step for me is very crucial because I just feel like with just wipes, the wipes just don't, it don't, it just get the surface makeup off. It doesn't really get the pores, like the makeup out of your pores. So for me, I usually go in with the Micellar Water and I get like two or three swabs, uh, not swabs, but like cotton rounds and just get the makeup off. Like as you can see, I will show y'all the cotton round. It like there's makeup still in your pores and you want to get the, all that makeup out. So that's why this step for me is very crucial because I also have very sensitive acne prone skin. And here, this is me going over my, my face again for the second time just to get that extra dirt off. I try to get my skin as clean as possible. So like I said, my skin is crazy and my skin will start breaking out at the drop of a dime. And now I'm just getting some cotton swabs and I'm just getting like the excess makeup off the bottom of my, uh, my eyelids. So I already got in the shower and I've um, taken my bath already. Now I'm just getting my wet rag and I usually always wet my face with hot water to open up my pores because you don't want to clean your face with like cold water because cold water doesn't open up your pores. So yes, I get hot water on my rag and I go ahead and just, you know, dampen up my face. Now I'm taking my brush head from uh, Ulta and my Mario Bugascu cleansing wash and I'm just gonna go over my face now i usually take a good like five minutes just cleaning my face by itself just because i like to you know get all the extra dirt and makeup out of my skin now whether if i'm wearing makeup or not i always do this step morning and night just to keep my face clean Now for my second wash, I go in with my Origins Scrub Cleanser. It just acts as a second wash for me and it also has little um, exfoliated beads in it to exfoliate your skin. So yes, I you know I like I like washing my face twice. And like I said, I usually do this whether if I'm wearing, wearing makeup or not, just to keep my face nice and clean. And now I'm drying my face off with a different towel. I always have a separate towel for my face to wash and to dry it. So I'm just drying off my skin. And now I'm just gonna go in with my Dickinson's Witch Hazel and I use it as a toner. And I'll just be going over my skin with that. Thank you. 
and I'm just um, fanning my face just so it can dry a little bit. And I'm just taking my African shea water, shea butter. I'm sorry, and I'm just using it as my moisturizer. It keeps my skin nice and soft. And now I'm just taking my Ni Nikeo or Nikeo. I don't really know how to pronounce it, but it's my face oil I like to use. Just to give me a little bit more moisture and to help get rid of my acne scars that I do have. Now I'm about to show you guys the mask that I use. I use these masks right here. I will list them down. Two of them are from Freeman and the other first one that I showed was from Formula 10.06. And now I'm just going in with my Victoria's Secret Lip Balm. You don't want to have crusty, chapped lips, so make sure you keep those lips moist.